There comes a point when it's time for your hard work to pay off. And you've determined to settle for nothing less than what you hoped for all along. That's the point where opportunity meets action. And dreams are realized. Yeah. Yeah, you on one? I must be on two. Keep it swain concept. Just like I say, my music is really about self motivation and you know you striving to be the best that you can be, not really conforming to what you know the 2013 trend is or what the world tells you to do. You know what I'm saying? Because I mean, my path is already you know kind of skewed from that. You know what I'm saying? I'm a black person in college that's pursuing a rap career. Like the two don't really you know mesh together. So keeping it swain by keeping it swain, I'm just maintaining my maintaining my life doing what I do you know what I'm saying and it's the same for for you or anybody else you know that's that's what I tell people through my music just you know do you I feel like with hip-hop you know in controversy to the newsroom black people are overrepresented and misrepresented at that you know there's a lot of there's a lot of black folks that I feel like the first thing you think of when you think of a rapper is a black dude with an icy chain some gold grills in his mouth you know you know that's just always talking about guns drugs money women stuff like that you know what I'm saying like that's what rap is and I, I just want to, I feel like I'm a perfect example of something that's not that, you know, somebody who's educated, has his head on straight and can still make music and still doing it and making positive music at that, you know, music that has the ability to change lives. So. This is, I believe it's called uh, Gator Night. And then that's like a, one of the events leading up to homecoming. And Gator Night's kind of like a competition in itself. It's supposed to be like a bigger stage though. And uh, you know, it's just got a lot of different acts in the top. You see the, the winner of the top two people get to perform mm -hmm. at homecoming. So that's like the ultimate goal. So that's what we're going for. All right, well I'll go ahead and start off with the latest one. Um, just a little background. This track is one that we actually, uh, my, my producers and I, 1934, remixed it with the uh, Popular song by Imagine Dragons, Radioactive. Y'all might have yeah. heard that one. Okay, so this is like a little hip hop spin on that one. Part of Alliance, backpack of dreams and a future full of triumph. They thought they had us caged, then we made a rebel's door. Bars for the cause, don't ask what I'm yelling for. Call me a freedom fighter, need a, need a lighter, need a writer. Seen inside of riches like the King of Midas. I got that sense, homie. Visionary method, too hot to crazy. To leave and if a hater intercepted Everybody know a real soldier when they see one So raise your palms, fight with arms in the war for freedom We seen the truth that the youth need someone to lead them One to restore the faith, someone to come to brief them So I break it down for them A crystal clear procedure, but I don't see a hater I don't hear them either So big brother can't tell me nothing I keep on trucking till I'm up I'm Waking up, and then the hook comes in. Yeah, three, five, two. I mean, it was fun. It was great. You know what I'm saying? I mean, like whenever you go into one of these type of things, I mean, you always just want to, I guess, set yourself apart the best way as possible. So I just go in there, you know, showing off my brand, give them the cards, the mixtape. You know, they seen the cameras. You know, so I'm hoping it all kind of ties into the thematic scheme of it all. Nick. You know, I, I manager, that's me. Nick manages himself. He gives me a lot more credit than, than I deserve. He's hungry. That's what brought me. I mean, Nick released his, I mean, I've been trying to work with Nick, you know, exclusively for, for some time now. Um, and that's just because, you know, being in my, my own being in Gainesville, you can walk outside right now, go down the street. I'm sure you're going to see the Keep It Swing sticker somewhere. You know, if you're going to make it, you're going to have to have something else more than just, you know, great music. And um, I think he has the, the, the work ethic to follow through with it. And he, he truly does. And like I said, he takes care of me. He sets shows up himself. I mean, like my job is really just to make sure he's organized and everything is, um, you know, when he does get to a show or whatever, we got the film or something there, or, you know, we're passing out mixtapes or something. Um, but I mean, he, he, you know, if, even if I was not here, Swain would still be doing 100% exactly what he's doing right now. That's why I like Swain a lot. I mean, there's it's, it's a lot of holes that need to be filled as far as financial needs, you know what I'm saying? And there's not always an immediate cash fund to go to. You know, some of it's asking family members for money, you know, who support me and can help me out. Some of it's just money that I've earned, you know, over time doing what I need to do. And, you know, some of it's just, it just seems to come out of nowhere, you know? But, you know, when they say if there's a will, there's a way, you know, it'll happen. So 
that will has been, I guess, what's kind of keeping my pocket going because it, it, it's a struggle, man, for sure. I can't sugarcoat it, but, uh, but you know, it's all worth it in the end. Too little, too late, the top of my class. Valedictorian, these rappers telling tales, but where's the story in you know, them from? Nothing to something, man, I'm somewhere in between. It's hard to say a buzz here in the world till I got agreements with pie. My mouth's steaming, reading the dictionary. These rappers blowing whack, and I'm trying to find a meaning. I'm Nick, I'm one half of 1934, and I'm a producer slash engineer. I'm Dylan, I am one half of 1934, and I'm engineer slash producer. That's right, man. What up, Dylan in the building? Hey, Doug, seeing the place to be. Okay, it's Swain. Hmm, yeah, Doug, seeing the place to be. I'm out for presidents to represent me. I'm out for presidents to represent me, homie. Ha. I mean, who's not? I got a cream and spit fire, my mouth's steaming. Reading the dictionary, these rappers blowing wagon, I'm trying to find the meaning. Well, I didn't get into Gator Growl. That's, I guess, the newest thing. Didn't make it. Uh, I actually just got the email yesterday saying they were like, yo, we uh, enjoyed your audition. Appreciate your time. Better luck next year, so. What's next from here? I mean, it's the same old thing. I mean, I'm not gonna stop. My train's still rolling, you know I mean? It's just. At the end of the day, it's just one, one show that I didn't do, you know, so, I mean, I would have liked to perform. I feel like it would have helped me, you know, reach out to the student population a little bit better, but, I mean, I'm just looking for other shows to do now, you know, like I say, the, the ball has to keep rolling, so I'm just moving on to the next thing, you know, whatever the next opportunity is that presents itself, that's, that's what I'm going for, so. I don't know, 10 years down the road, honestly, I just, I just want to be heard. <laughs> you know, plain and simple, I just want to be heard. You know, 10 years from now, you're going to know who I am. I mean, you all knew, but, you know, you, people, the world will know who I am for sure. You know, I definitely plan on making my music transcendent enough so that people of all ages, of all races, and from wherever you are can relate to it on some kind of level. In five to 10 years, well... I believe a goal without a plan is a wish. So I have a plan for us for five years. So in five years, I see us as being a nationally recognized collective group. You know, I see Swain, um, you know, making music that is heard on a national level. Um, in ten years, I see Swain, you know, being regarded as one of the best of our generation. So I, I, I just want my music to last. That's all I can really ask is, you know, they say the man dies, but the voice lives on. You know, it's, it's all about your message, like I say. So I'm trying to have that. I'm trying to have that in 10 years. I want to be, I want, I want to be remembered. Yes, look, look, I'm nice. Don't ever get me confused with rude. I'll expose it like being on the tube and nude. Rolling in the finest of circles that you exclude. We know who's the dude, like food gets brewed and stewed. So you taste like a sample of reality, I right? Only thing is, you forgot that reality bites and it's a lot worse than it's part. Put a flash that on a ratchet. Now try to say I'm a shot in the dark. I don't believe you. Although I am religious, it's like I'm possessed the way I'm speaking to the Holy Spirit. I don't mean I'm perfect, homie, nah, I'm far from it Living in my own skin, stone still in the wind, okay Life gave me limits, but I still make Kool-Aid Tardy midget, you too little, too late Top of my class, valedictorian These rappers telling tales, but where's the story? And you know, I'm from nothing to something I'm somewhere in between it Shawty say a pussy run the world Till I got a cream and spit fire My mouth steaming, reading the dictionary Cause these rappers blowing whack And I'm trying to find the meaning